Joel George waiting in the wings. We're, we're, come on in here before the banner falls. Before the banner falls. How are you, man? Well, thanks. You, Doug? I'm doing great. And, uh, you know, a lot of exciting stuff you're working on locally. Tell us about the group you're working on, the the funding project you're working on, everything. Yeah, well, um, I guess where to start? Uh, Cinema Quinty is a group that we started a few years ago. Uh, It's a way for local artists to read their scripts in a roundtable setting, get some feedback from the other members of the group, um, and just uh, improve on our writing. And then one of the scripts is so great, we had an opportunity to actually turn that into a short film. Nice. Um, so that's, uh, we, we've since incorporated that into a not-for-profit organization now. So it's sort of a filmmaker support locally here uh, in the Quinney area. And uh, I, we want it to be a resource uh, yeah. you know, for, for filmmakers in the area. Uh, along with that now, we're also going ahead, we've rebranded the film festival that we've done in the past that there used to go. be known as the Movie Years Today. Yeah. It is now known as the Quinney Canadian Film Fest. Awesome. So it's showcasing the, uh, you know, sort of the best of our local films alongside of the best of Canadian film. So we're bridging that, uh, that sort of gap and, and presenting our local filmmakers along with the, the best in the country. And um, you know, I, I think that we have a lot of great talent here to yeah. showcase and uh, certainly bring out a crowd to you know to show to our local uh, um, public here as well. Sure, I think a lot of people. I mean, we've talked about this before. I think a lot of people don't realize how much talent there is. You know, again, we got I think it's 16 local films in this year's festival. Mm-hmm. I mentioned Quinny West. You got some great support from uh, their Tourism and Economic Development Committee. How does that feel in terms of trying to build momentum in what you're doing? Well, it's really exciting because uh, for us, it means that the city's actually standing behind us now and, and, and willing to support us in a greater way than uh, than they have in the past. And it's it's not because they weren't, um, you know, they, they weren't going to support us or anything. It's because we we didn't really have, uh, you know, the the infrastructure to, to make the, the request or to ask for it. Um, so it's something that they've uh, made public that they're prioritizing, that they're really, uh, you know, trying to support the kind of efforts that we're doing there with uh, with the film work. Yeah. And uh, yeah, really something that we can all. You know, work together on and, and make something. Uh, you know, hopefully that will last for a long time and sort of kickstart this uh, may, maybe a bit of a film renaissance in the area. Sure, because, I love uh, it. Film you know, renaissance. Well, you heard it first here. This is the Quinty <laughs> film renaissance going on. So where do people go for more info? Uh, well, best place to go is QuintyFilmFest.ca. Um, yeah, look for the Quinty Canadian Film Fest on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Uh, lots of information coming up, and uh, we'll be releasing some information about films in the next few months. And there's actually a really big announcement coming we're going to be having a film contest as well before the festival so that the winners of the film contest will get into the festival um yeah and it's it's a really great way to engage with some of the youth in our area too here so keep your eyes open for that as well beautiful man always great to see you always thanks so much thanks so much yeah we'll see you soon